Hello and welcome to my video review of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now this game has been out for about a week now. Um, I realize there's probably a ton of other video reviews out there. Um, but I wanted to give my initial impressions of the game. After playing it um, pretty much all the way through the campaign. Uh, some of the multiplayer and uh, really taking some time to appreciate what this game is. Um, this game is actually made by Sledgehammer Games. Now, for those of you that aren't familiar with the Sledgehammer Studio, um, they're the guys that basically made the Dead Space series. Uh, they left to go work on something new, and this is what we got. And, oh my god, is this amazing. Uh, really, the gameplay is excellent. It's very tight. It's very fast-paced versus other traditional Call of Duty games. Now, the interesting thing with it is is that it's set in the future. So there's the exosuits, and there's a ton of um, tech goodies that really make this game kind of stand out among the other members of its franchise. I really enjoy this game, and I've been kind of lackluster on the Call of Duty games over the last couple of years. Um, not to say that I didn't appreciate them. I really liked Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2. They were great for what they were. Um, but at the end of the day, there was always something kind of missing from them uh, that I didn't get out of the, like, the Modern Warfare series, um, that I just didn't like. And I really wasn't excited to play this game. I picked it up, I uh, thought I'd give it a try, see what I could do with it, um, and I really loved it. The first initial thing is, is the graphics. These are really a great showcase of next-gen graphics. Um, pretty much all the cutscenes look like you're watching a movie. Kevin Spacey looks amazing in it. Um, and I really have to say that the whole concept behind the story is very well thought out. This isn't a typical Call of Duty, hey, go here, kill this. I mean, yes, it does follow the franchise roots of you're going to follow this person through a level, you're going to kill a million people, and uh, you're going to save the day at the end of the day. But the difference between this and something like Ghost is this is something that I feel was given enough time to make the concept actually work. Versus, okay, you have a year to come up with a really good Call of Duty. Um, one of the things that I think I'm most impressed with in thinking about it is the way the tech is used. It's not used in a campy, oh, oh my god, you gotta do this, and this is the only tool that you could use for it. It is basically, you have these tech tools at your disposal, use them as you see fit. Yes, there are some times where it's forced, like using the climb mechanic, uh, there's a grappling hook that you're going to use later on that, yes, it is very forced, but that's okay. It works in the context of the story. Um, there are some other parts of tech that really shine through in this particular game, and that's things like the Wasp mission that I'm going to show a video of at the end of this, where you're using an unmanned drone to kind of cover and survey your teammates from far away. And it's actually done in a really clever manner. Something that I think Sledgehammer is really good at is making future tech accessible. If you look at the Dead Space franchise, a lot of that technology didn't seem too far-fetched for what it actually was. Sometimes when you get companies that want to do tech, it becomes, oh, okay, it's all lasers and robots, and this really isn't that. Yes, there are exosuits. Is that a believable technology? Yeah, it actually kind of is in the way that it's actually positioned in this game. It's not like you're climbing into a giant robot. It's a suit that kind of attaches at your spine, wraps around your waist, goes down your arms and your legs, but it doesn't obstruct the view of it. And that's one of the things that I really like about this particular game, is when you look at the character models, the character models have depth and they have texture to them. You can see multiple layers and multiple different types of fabric, multiple layers and multiple different types of technology that's on the actual players. So overall, if I had to actually give this game a rating, I would actually give it a solid 9 out of 10 for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now the reason I'm going with 9 out of 10 is this campaign is again very short. I know everybody out there says, oh, Call of Duty is all about the multiplayer and it's not really about the campaign. But you got to remember, at the end of the day, the campaign is something that if some players are drawn to, it brings more customers into the game. So the more customers there are into the game, the better the multiplayer experience is going to be because you may have somebody out there that's never tried a shooter in their past, but now that they have the opportunity to try a campaign that they really like and they say, hey, I'm kind of good with this technology, they might actually want to step into the realm of multiplayer. Now the multiplayer in this game is something that I'm actually really enjoying because the technology and the ability to kind of move around freely and very fast actually kind of gets away from a traditional Call of Duty multiplayer 
problem. And that's campers. Okay? I'm not going to deny it. I hate them because they kill me. But this game really does move at a fast enough pace that it actually makes camping extremely hard to do. Um, and with that being said, I really enjoy the multiplayer, which I haven't enjoyed multiplayer in a Call of Duty game for quite a while. I played it in Black Ops. I played it in Black Ops 2. I didn't really like either of them. I didn't really like the one in Ghost. But I did like it back in the day, back in the Modern Warfare series. Now, there are a few missions in this particular game that I actually think really stand out that are going to live up to that legacy of, like, the ghillie suit mission that everybody talks about when comparing Call of Duties to themselves. There's a ton of really well-thought-out missions here. So, overall, I have to say kudos to the guys at Sledgehammer and Raven Games, and I'm sure I'm missing other ones on here. Um, Sledgehammer, Raven, and High Moon. So, three different studios working on this. They've turned out an excellent product. So, with that, I'm going to turn it over to the gameplay footage that I uploaded earlier. I'm going to segment that into this video. And if you like it, go ahead and hit the like button. Uh, if you want to see more great quality reviews, please feel free to subscribe. I'll be putting up as many as I can as time goes on. Um, I also have a ton of VTuber reviews that I've done and a couple other PlayStation 4 games as well. So with that, thank you for watching and uh, enjoy the footage. Scan for comm signals. You'll have to zoom in for a proper scan. Now, look for the KVA comm signal. That'll be our ticket inside the safe house. There, check him out. He's not here. Switch to another camera. There, check him out. No match, move on. KVA signal is close. Keep looking. We're running out of time. We're running out of time. There, check him out. Com signal is a KVA match. He's our key man. That's our ticket inside. Bravo moving. I don't need to remind you how important this mission is. Hades is responsible for the nuclear attacks four years ago. We bring him down, we bring down the whole KVA network. There's no room for error. Get it done. Loose follow, then take him out. I'll clear out the back. Don't cock this up, ladies. This is private property. You need to leave. I'm looking for the market. I guess I got lost. It's not here. What? <laughs> nice work. Weapons ready. Bravo has the key card. Alpha, be advised. Bravo is on the X. Roger that. Hold up, sure painting targets. I'll check in every quarter hour. Spot in this alley from that vantage point. Patrol, Have take a man him. Upstairs.
This one's mine. All stations will be Wait for them to finish. Time, sir. Your meeting will go uninterrupted. It had better, or you will answer directly to me. Understood. Kate is out. Drop him. Prophet, safe house is clear. We'll put eyes on the conference center. Copy that, Bravo. Alpha, you are clear for phase two. Copy. Alpha's loading up the truck. Mitchell, put on your exosuit. I'll assemble the wasp. Let's kid up. <laughs> Prophet, wasp ready for launch. Alpha, in position. Standing by. Copy that. Stand by for wasp. Take the drone, Mitchell. I'll put ears on Halo's meeting. Wasp is airborne. 200 meters to target. Zoom in on that conference room. There. Have eyes on Hades. Wish we could pop them right now. Easy, Alan. Get the intel first. Alpha's truck is rolling to the gate. Alpha, go black. Wasp will start the party. Wait for the guards to get close, then drop them. Hey! You! You cannot park here! Tighten it up, Mitchell. Alpha ready to breach. Mitchell, I'll call your targets. Shoot the two on the overwatch. Alpha, move it. Could be unclear. Alpha, hold. You have a watcher inside. Got him. Good job. All stations, hard compromise. Abort, abort, abort. Good job. Shit. Gideon is in trouble. Thanks for the assist. It's clear. Alpha, move up. Mitchell, drop two. Alpha will mop up. Pool is clear. Alpha moving. Alpha in position. Placing the mute charge. Mute charge ready. Copy that, Alpha. Mitchell, swing around and cover the glass side of the atrium. Charge only gives limited coverage. Clear him out fast. Nice job. Atrium is clear. All stations, be advised. It looks as though Hades is starting the meeting. Roger that, Pro. Prophet, step it up, Alpha. Don't want to miss the big pitch. Copy that. Shoot two at the top of the stairs. Kill confirmed. Need to pull KBA off that door so Alpha can move in. Trip a car alarm. Let's check it out. KVA is moving. Wasp, hit the three heading for the car. Wasp, you've been spotted. Abort the mission. I repeat, abort the mission. KVA off that door so Alpha can move in. Trip a car alarm. Let's check it out. KVA is moving. Wasp, hit the three headed for the car. No, thank you. Clear. Alpha moving to breach point. Mitchell, get eyes on that meeting. 
Line up Hades nice and clean. All teams stand by for breach. Hold fire now. until my mark. I keep it close to me at all times. It will keep us safe. You will contact him again for further payment. They have two days. That's it. Was the take the shot. It is is down. Alpha, put in it from the kill. Scanning red. Right. 